In today's video, I'm going to be showing you the absolute yeah. easiest and quickest way that you can get started dropshipping using AI. It's just going to be easy, squeezy, boom, boom, I'm done. AI lately has been absolutely everywhere and in a lot of different businesses. A lot of different businesses are currently taking advantage of AI to automate a big portion of their day to day tasks. And dropshipping is no different. There's a lot of different things that AI has been inserted to into dropshipping to make it that much easier for you to start. So with that being said, the first thing that we're going to get started with is creating our Shopify store. Now, of course, this is the easiest way to get started with AI. So we're going to use AI to build our Shopify store for us. Now, before we continue, if you want access to the cheat sheet where I'm going to be laying out everything that I'm talking about in today's video, then make sure you go ahead and comment down below the hashtag Shopify AI and let me know what your takeaway is from this video. Once I see that you went ahead and did that, I'll reply back with a link to the sheet. So first things first, we need to create our Shopify store. And of course, again, we're going to use AI for this. Now, the one prerequisite that we need is to have an AutoDS account. The reason for this is because the AI store builder is going to be inside AutoDS. So if you haven't started with us just yet, or if you're on the fence of getting started, then you can check us out for the trial period for just $1 for the next two weeks. Now, once you have everything set up and ready to go, the first thing you're going to see once you sign on is going to be this over here. What we're going to do to start is simply click on add store. Now from here, if you already have a store, you're going to see this option. If not, you're going to see this. If you're brand new, we're going to click on Shopify store, build with AI, go ahead and continue. And we're going to choose the middle option. We're going to go with AI to generate a pre-built Shopify store. Go ahead and continue. And now we have to select a niche. Now, what are we going to go with? My suggestion to you is choose something that you're actually passionate about or something that you actually like simply because it's going to be easier for you to do the product research and actually find the benefits behind each product. Now, me personally, I love electronics and gadgets. That's something that I know a lot about, but I'm a very big advocate for drop shipping pet products because everyone loves their pets. So for this, we're going to switch it up a little bit and we're actually going to go with electronics and gadgets. Go ahead and click on next and AI is going to be building our store for us. Now that's pretty much it. You saw how easy that was. It's all set. What we need to do now is go ahead and log in. So let's click on copy over here for our email, open the Shopify store. Now let's type in our email, copy over our password and we're in. The next thing we need to do now is go ahead and select the plan. Once you're on this page, my suggestion to you is to just go ahead with the basic. You don't need all of the extras from these other accounts, at least not yet, maybe later on once you start scaling. But to get started, the basic is going to be just fine. And you can get started for just $1 for the next month. Now, this is for now. These promotions are subject to change. So if when you're watching this video, it's not the same promotion, then you already know why. Now, once we have our plan selected, the next thing we want to do is just go ahead and check out our online store. Let's see what it looks like. And here we have the cloud store, which is actually a pretty interesting name because, you know, the cloud, Internet, it works pretty well together. Now, taking a quick look over everything, we have cutting edge lifestyle, the latest in tech. The banners look pretty nice. This one's actually very clean. The logo's pretty, pretty decent. We can do a little bit of a better job with this, but a little bit more on that later. Let's check out the products that it comes preloaded with. So when you create your Shopify store using the AutoDS AI Shopify builder, you get products automatically added that are handpicked by expert dropshippers. All of these different products are proven best sellers and are currently trending. So these are just a few of the ones that were imported. This is pretty cool, a smart ring. I've seen that before. And then if you keep scrolling, you have some reviews for the store and all of your different pages. You have your policy pages, your shipping pages, your social medias, and everything else that you need in your typical store. My suggestion to you though, is go ahead and click on all of these different policies. Like let's say the shipping policy, read over everything and just make sure that everything's accurate. Your store name, because most likely you're not going to go with the default store name. So change it to whatever you want it to be. Make sure that your shipping policy is actually correct. Like here it says one to two business days, make sure that's accurate. Go through everything, change whatever you need to change. And same goes for the other policies, the return policy and the terms and conditions. Now, as far as getting started with our store, that's pretty much it. Our store is ready to go live. The only thing that we need to do is simply remove the password so our customers can go in freely. Now, besides that, the next thing that I want to show you is the marketplace. So you can use AI to find some of the most trending products online that a lot of people haven't discovered yet. In order to do that, you simply just go ahead and run back over to your AutoDS account, click on the marketplace and then look for trending products. What I spoke to you about earlier, the ones that were already preloaded, that's from the handpicked products over here. Again, these are all handpicked by expert dropshippers, but the trending product section is a bit different. These are all imported by AI. So AI goes out in the internet and it scours a lot of different pages, all social media, and it looks for products that could potentially be trending or could potentially start to trend. And then it imports everything onto this page. So you can go through this, see what's trending, see what people are looking at, see what's making some buzz online and see if any of these fit your store. 
Now, one way that you can do this is simply by using the filters up here. So we're in the electronics and gadgets, and these are all of the different ones that we can go ahead and import to our store. Now, be a bit careful here because since it is AI that's importing all of these products, you might find some branded products, like let's say these Lenovo headphones. So just don't do those, but look at everything else. Like look at this cordless vacuum. This actually looks very similar to our shark vacuum that we just bought. Besides that, you have portable monitors. Portable monitors are huge. Solar powered phone chargers, Android tablets. You got a little bit of pretty much everything here. Now, let's say you find something that you're interested in. Let's say this charger right here. All we have to do is simply click on import draft, and then it's gonna be imported to our draft section. Over here, we can click on drafts. We see our product over here, the one we just imported, the phone case. Click to edit. And on here, you can also use AI to optimize your title and your description. So all we have to do is simply click on optimize with AI. We can choose a tone. Do we wanna make it sound professional, sellable, funny, or optimized for social networks like TikTok, Instagram? In this case, I'm gonna go with professional because of the type of product that it is. And as far as the temperature, do we want it to be creative or precise? So this is pretty much gonna be taking the text that's already on the title section, and it's gonna create a title based off of that. So I'm just gonna leave it as balanced and click on AI, right? And then here we have the professional title, GNC W22 Power Bank Wireless Charger with multiple outlets. Now this is pretty long, but we can go ahead and save it. And as you can see, it already shortened the one that was already there. We can remove the beginning, which is a professional title. And then from here, we can optimize it further if we wanna make it a little bit shorter or a bit more precise or detailed. Same goes for the description. You can optimize your entire description using AI as well. And looking at the variant section, let's go ahead and click to edit one of these. Here, this is my favorite part. This takes the entire guesswork out of pricing your products. So how much in fees do you want to take into consideration? Let's take, for example, something crazy, 18%. As far as a fee dollar amount, let's take $5. Again, these are just examples so I can show you the pricing and how it works. Now our profit, I want it to be $100, 100%. Profit dollar amount, we can leave that empty. And we can see here that our buy price is $35.81. Our total profit is going to be $35.81 because we want 100% profit. But what about the 18% fees? Well, that's already going to be included in the selling price of $93.44, including these $5 as well. So these two fees are going to be taken into consideration to the selling price, and they're already going to be deducted from your total profit. So that way, what you see here is what you're going to be receiving from your customer after your fees. Pretty cool, huh? Straight to the point, easy to use. So here, all we have to do is click on save. And then once we're ready for this product to go live into our store, all we do is click on save and import, and it'll be uploaded to our store within a few seconds. And once it's finished importing, then we have it here on our store and it's ready to sell. All right, so now we're over at Kittle where we can go ahead and create a logo using AI. And I really like the logo idea that was originally on the store, which is the cloud logo. So I went with something similar, a cloud logo with circuitry lines inside of it. But if you can't think of anything, if you don't like it, then you can simply just go to ChatGPT and ask it for a few different logo ideas and store names, and then just go from there. But this is something that I thought about pretty quickly as soon as I saw the logo. So let's go ahead and do that. Now with Kittle AI, you get the options to choose a few different art styles. And I always like going with clip art styles as either a mascot, kawaii, or cartoon. These are the best ones for logos. For this, let's go with mascot and let's see what it does. Okay, so it finished and this is the logo it came out with. And I absolutely love it. I think this is perfect. So the only extra thing I'm gonna do is add a little bit of text. So I'm just gonna add a headline and I'm gonna call it Cloud Store since that's what was originally on there. Let's go ahead and give it a little bit of a twist. That looks pretty cool. Something like that, something simple, just for example purposes. All right, so now all we have to do is simply go ahead and download the image. Now we're gonna go back to our Shopify store. We're gonna click under online store. We're gonna go to the themes and we're gonna click on customize. Then click on the header up here where your logo is. And you're gonna see that it says edit your logo in theme settings. So you can just go ahead and click on that and select your image from there. So add images. All right, once that's done, we can go ahead and make it a little bit bigger by adjusting the logo width, and it should update shortly. Let's just go ahead and save it. And this is where it's gonna go. So as you can see, we have our new logo and everything else looks pretty clean. And that's pretty much the easiest way that you can get started dropshipping using AI. As you saw, it's very quick, it's very easy, it's very efficient, and it really cuts out a massive chunk of the entire process to get started. When you create your online store by yourself and you start designing everything, putting together all the colors, the images, it takes some time, and especially if you're not very good at the actual design aspect of this. So being able to create your store using AI is an immense time saver. So what did you think of today's video? What do you think about using AI to get started drop shipping? Let me know all of your thoughts down in the comments below. Remember, if you want access to the cheat sheet, all you have to do is go ahead and comment the hashtag Shopify AI and let me know what your takeaway is from this video. Huge thank you to everyone for watching, especially if you made it all the way to the end. As always, smash that like button, hit that subscribe button and ring that little bell notification so you don't miss out on any future videos. My name is Mario with AutoDS. I'll catch you guys next time.